Hello guys, welcome back to part 3 of... She called me Johnny. Raiden told me later that I'm descended from some Mediterranean war cult. Bred as warriors for the gods. I've never been able to resummon that green halo. Raiden thinks it was triggered when I saw a loved one about to die. <laughs> How about you, Cassie? Can you summon anything like that? Or did it skip a generation? Take it easy, Jin. We didn't need a halo in Darfur. Or Iran. Or Kurdistan. Did we, Jackie? Nope, we didn't. Shaolin monks ever send you there, Jin? I've seen plenty of action. Takeda and I both. Stuff that blow your special forces mind. At ease. You're all here because you deserve to be. You're beautiful and unique snowflakes. Now, as I'm sure you're unaware, judging from the lack of gift cards, today is our team's six-week anniversary. Secretary Blake says he's pleased with our progress. You could spit in his hair and he'd be pleased with our progress. He was smart enough to have Mr. Cage put this team together. I'm glad the Shira Ryu chose me to join. New places, new faces. As the Secretary pointed out, us older folks are gonna retire someday. So it's time for your generation to step up. Shaolin, Shirai Ryu, SF. Together. For your team's first mission, you're going to the Lin Kuei Temple. We haven't heard from the Grand Master in a while, so we need to make sure he's still on our side. That he's got our backs if things flare up again with Outworld. You need to bring him in. But don't be surprised if Sub-Zero's not willing to cooperate. Why be worried about Outworld? I thought Kotal Khan respected the Reiko Accords. He does, but he's facing a civil war. The Rebels win, those Accords will be history. The expression it's not worth a dirt on my shoe. Koto Khan has always bargained with you fairly, you know. Sure, sure. I'm just saying. Upgraded weapons, my intel, and poof. The long outworld civil war. Done. Might be nice to kick back a bit, eh? You know Melina's location. And a whole rebel army. It's got to be worth at least 50. I must attack her immediately. End this conflict. As you say, it drains us. Right. Do we have a deal? What is it, Devora? The Emperor should not be concerned. Accident ahead. This one will clear it. Make way for Kotal Khan! Move! The Tarkatans are in position. We await your order. It is given, dearest Tanya. Stopping a carriage is nothing. Killing an Emperor... False Emperor! ...requires power. Power you have, Melina. And won't use. It pains me to use it, Rain. I need more time. The usurper's excursion came too soon. The rain falls when it may. No matter. If Kano does what I paid him to do. Now! Do it!
Talk, 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 Nore. You said a mouthful. Melina's given me twice that to take you out. Damn. Kano be an ass. Oh. Interesting little fact about Kano. His uh, eye has changed since um, Mortal Kombat 9. Because of a. Uh, he had a fight with Sub Zero, and Sub Zero ripped out of it, ripped his old uh, skull unit out of his head. Quite a gory little battle, as it would be. But quite like Kodo Khan, he seems to be a better emperor than uh, Shao Kahn was. I don't remember who Shao Kahn was, he was the Emperor of Outworld in uh, well, most of the Mortal Kombat games. You're not worth the dirt on my shoe. I'm pleased you remember me, Koata. I will never forget those who freed Melina. She vowed to create a free Edinia, something you refused to do. A united outworld stands strong against its enemies. It will never be united under your rule. Your rebellion is all that prevents it. Yeah, I don't remember who Tanya is in the, in the game. But Melina is the uh, daughter Shao Kahn had created in Mortal Kombat 9. She was meant to be act as a sister to Tanya. And then he was going to be uh, Emperor and the Shogun. I guess everything went a bit wrong between 9 and 10. And that's how Koda Khan has become Emperor instead of Molina.
You are a fool to trust Melina. She tasks me for the last time. Melina. Kano was to kill you, miserable snake! Rubronate! Another Adenian, the supposed half god. Kogatir! I am a son of Argus. I was not merely declared a god by befuddled commoners, Bulak. Surely Melina suspects your true intentions, son of Argus. <laughs> He is the assassin reign. Used to look a lot like a, a sub zero scorpion back in the old days. Hold him all kind of. Where did I go? The old lady! you. You won't touch him again. But I will. As the heir to my father, Shao Kahn, I, Melina, Kahnam of Outworld, order your execution! Oh, damn. I'm old lady. This video is obviously going to be a little longer than previous ones. I don't want to stop it uh, in the middle of the fight and stuff. Lord, woman. That's what I wanted to do. I don't know why, I'm not quite sure how I just did that. Well, that was close. The fitty, look. Get serious. Uh, 
Not quite sure how you could get back up from that, to be honest. Oh, bit of a backhand there to finish. There will be an execution this day. You will atone for your descent, Melina. Your blood will make right. Up the stair path. To the fire's edge. A mere cub, grown to be a jaguar. Damn it, Jin. You! I need to. You are not welcome here. State your intentions. Grandmaster, we need you to come with us. My name is Sergeant... You demand my cooperation, yet you are cut off, surrounded. What will you do? My father always spoke highly of you, Sub-Zero. He wants to talk. Talking. Always his first choice.